Coachella. Get it up. Hey Bays. That's B A E in case you were confused, not B A B E. We're not babes, we're bays. Anyways, so as some of you may know, there was this huge music festival. Um tons of people go, celebrities, Coachella is what it is, that's what I'm talking about. So I've been seeing a lot of not a lot, a couple people doing reviewing or reacting to Coachella outfits and I thought it would be like a fun little twisty toasters if I did like celebrities versus youtubers I think that could be super fun because I don't know I just thought of it and thought it would be fun okay anyways let's get started okay so we're gonna be starting with the celebrities and our first celebrity is Amber Rose I don't hate it, but it's not Coachella. Like when I see that outfit, I think like, I don't know, a club or like an event, but not like Coachella, you know? It's not Coachella vibes, you know? It's <laughs> Rihanna obviously gets the point just by being herself. The outfit slays, she looks better than I could ever even imagine looking, so that really hurts my ego a little bit, but. <laughs> Iggy Azalea. This is my numero uno Coachella pet peeve, is when stars, celebrities, YouTubers just wear a white crop top and blue jeans. That gets no points, a big fat zero, because you're styled for the event, Come up with something better here, sister. Nothing spectacular, honestly. Celebrities have not blown me away except for Rihanna, but she will... <sighs> Don't even need to talk about that. Okay, Darren Chris. He looks flawless. Um, his shirt and his pants, the patterns clash, but like, why does it, why does it work when he looks like his patterns like clash, but like, I wear like sweatpants and yoga pants, sweatpants and like a sweatshirt and I can't even like look decent ever. Uh, Jordan Woods, Kourtney Kardashian, and Kylie Jenner. Kylie Jenner is the queen of switching hairs. Hairs, hair. We love it. She killed the denim and the pink. Both of them are perfect. And this this little like latexy look, it's it's not exactly what I would think of when I think Coachella, but it's innovative. Jordan Woods, that that's what Coachella looks like to me. She's really killing it right there. So Jamie Foxx, an all red moment. We love all red. Red is a great color. It's a great color on everyone and he, he killed it quite a bit. So good job, buddy. Why didn't I call him Buddy? That was so weird. Charlie XCX. She went for the all denim look. I like it this time. I'm not really sure why, but I do. But isn't doesn't it isn't it hot? Like why? How are people wearing jeans? That's so confusing. Isn't it so hot? And those shoes don't look very comfortable. Like you're walking a lot. Like maybe that's just for a party, but. I don't know, it's just kind of confusing. Jean doesn't really scream Coachella to me. YouTubers. Okay, Tyler Oakley. Um, his every look he did this weekend was so good. He really killed it, especially in this look with the overalls, no shirt. That's bold. That's a bold sister. We love a bold sister. Yellow cap, yellow, love yellow. Um, that light blue with the light blue, uh, the light blue Meredith Foster, I, I mean, she looks good, but it's just, it's just, it's not my favorite look of Coke, Coke, not my favorite look of Coachella, that's what I'm trying to say. Chloe Feldman, that's a lot of glitter, but I'm, I don't hate it, it's a music festival, like, she went all out and she killed it, like, 
but that's so much glitter with especially with the top and it's just all over that must have taken forever so props to her for doing that forever and that's very Coachella Tila Dunn she's the new queen of Coachella everyone I'm proclaiming it for her she is the new queen of Coachella and she deserves it she killed every single look Vanessa Hudgens doesn't even want her title anymore and I think she should give her title to Tila that's all I've got to say. Okay, Emma Chamberlain. She certifiably killed the look first day one. It was not what I was expecting at all from her, but she came in, it was innovative, and it was fresh, and it was funky, and it was glittery, and we love glitter over here. So nice job, sister. Keep it up. Eh. Speaking of sisters, we have James Charles. Um, I was on Twitter the other day and I saw he's been getting a lot of hate for wearing the chaps. Ew, I, <laughs> I don't like that word at all, actually, but, um, I mean, he killed it. Like, he, it's not like he has some ugly butt, like, his butt's fine, you know? So, I mean, he came out and he killed it, sister, and I don't get how you could even be mad about that because he, I mean, he tried his best and he's killing it, you know? And our final YouTuber is Tana Mojo. Okay, she killed it with the eye look, especially with the glittery bottoms, glittery, glitterly? Glitterly, I'm glitterly not kidding you. She killed it. Um, with the fanny pack, the chain, you know, she just, she brought in edgy and funky and uh, good job, sister. She killed it. Why do I even talk? YouTubers won and like I don't even know the numbers because I didn't really keep track but I think the YouTubers they just like they brought Coachella vibes which is I think something that the celebrities didn't I feel like celebrities kind of went with like a more toned down look but when you go to Co Coachella I feel like you have to go hard and I feel like the YouTubers they just really brought it this year so the YouTubers won round of applause for them So thanks for watching this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big ol' tumsy upsies down in the comments. Make sure to leave a comment if you liked it or if you think I should do more videos like this. He literally almost just hit my brother's car. Anyway, so make sure to leave a comment if you think I should do more videos like this or if I shouldn't, make sure to um, hurt my feelings then make sure to subscribe i would genuinely appreciate it a bunch and yeah kisses and well wishes